Another religion that branches away from Hinduism is Buddhism. Siddhartha Gautama was a founder of Buddhism. Um, we've spent a lot of time in class talking about his journey to enlightenment. He's born into a very upper class family in India. There's a prophecy made at the time of his birth that if his family can keep him isolated from the suffering of the world, he'll become a great political leader. If he goes out and experiences the world, he'll become a great religious leader. So they try to keep him isolated, but it does not work forever. Um, eventually, he ends up going out into the world to seek enlightenment, and he does find it. The term Buddha does not mean God. There, there are a lot of misconceptions about Buddhism kind of out there in the world. Buddha means enlightened one. So Buddha, the founder of the religion, is not the only one that we would consider a Buddha. Um, it just means it's a person who has achieved enlightenment or who has reached this state of perfect wisdom. Buddha is not considered a god. They do not worship Buddha through the religion Buddhism. Now, one of the things that Buddha discovers when he becomes enlightened is the Four Noble Truths. And I'm going to paraphrase these in my own words. Life is suffering. People suffer because of their desires. To eliminate suffering, one should eliminate desire. And to eliminate desire, you follow the Eightfold Path. So the, eight, the Eightfold Path, that's my cat destroying the chair. The Eightfold Path would be all of those steps together that people need to actively work toward in order to achieve enlightenment if they are Buddhist. It's called the Eightfold Path because there are eight parts. A lot of these for me are hard to remember because there's so much overlap in the meaning of the terms. Um, but some of the parts of the Eightfold Path, for example, are right mindfulness, right concentration, right speech, right thought, right livelihood, okay? So the way that people act and think and treat others, um, the time that they spend meditating, the focus, the concentration that they have, should help lead them closer to enlightenment.